Do you know where I can find a taxi? Have you ever wondered what's really happening in your brain when a reggaeton beat drops? Your ears don't just hear sounds, they perceive vibrations. Every note, every tone, every beat emits a frequency. Instantly, your heart rate and breathing accelerate, trying to sync with the rhythm. It's that unstoppable urge to move. But what about the lyrics? Picture your brain as a lush green field. If an idea crosses it just once, it barely leaves a trace. But when a song hammers the same lyrics into your head 30 times, I'm your horse, ride me in my golden garden, you're my obsession, I hate myself when I see you with another, it leaves a mark. Poetic as the words may sound, your brain is absorbing them. As they pass over and over again, the idea carves a small neural path in that field. And if it keeps passing again and again and again, it can build a full-blown neural highway. Then, without you even realizing it, when you have to think about love, money, or yourself, which path do you think your thoughts will take to save energy? Obviously, the one that's most established. Repetition after repetition, you are becoming the song. And look, we're not telling you to stop listening to reggaeton. Every type of music has its purpose, and reggaeton is perfect for connecting with people on the dance floor. Our only question is, are you aware of the neural pathways you're building in your mind? because some music is designed to do the exact opposite. Compositions like Beethoven's Moonlight Sonata, for example, are renowned for their ability to bring order to the mind and literally signal your brain to lower its production of cortisol, the stress hormone. The musical architecture of Mozart with its structured frequencies sharpens reasoning and mental clarity. And today, specialists like Hector Castillo, founder of MyEek.pro, are using science to design specific music that reduces anxiety and combats stress on a physiological level. There is music, frequencies, and harmonies that opens doors in your mind, relaxing you, focusing you, awakening your creativity, or helping you heal. But there is also music that agitates you, generates anxiety, and traps you in a loop of negative thoughts. In the end, your brain simply processes patterns. The good news is that music is like source code you can inject directly into your mind. The decision of how you program your mind is yours. Thanks, but I had only asked you for the taxi stand.